our family. Okay, drone here. What's going on, guys? We've got these two batteries here, and I want to turn them into a two cell. So what I've done is I've created a little wire harness. Uh, the extension is a lot longer because it was actually meant to make two two S batteries and no four cell. And uh, all we've done here is we've connected our positive and negative here, which is that bridge, and we've let out with our negative and let out with our positive, and at this end here, now we have two cell battery. Um, some people are concerned about my connection. They're not rated for two cell. As you can see over here, lossy connection. This is a two cell battery. This is a two cell battery, and it's same same wire, same connection. We should be just fine. The real concern comes over to two cell when I decide to connect these, which they will connect up here and up here to make a four cell. People are concerned about that connection, but we're not going to test these right now. We're going to give these a test. These are brand new batteries, same company, same name, just like these are same company, same name, um, same voltage as well. So let's go. DM009 test dummy. Um, so we have that connection. We have both those batteries in there, which are 3.7 volt, 850 milliamp an hour. We've increased the voltage um, to 7.4, 8.2, fully charged, and uh, they're it's still 800 milliamp an hour. So we have a little bit higher milliamp an hour. We have higher volts. Uh, is this gonna explode? I don't know. We're gonna find out. And uh, let me tell you, those two batteries in there fit tighter than an OJ glove. Whoa, you can't say that. Yeah, I said it. It's the truth. They're in there mad tight. Um, but we got a lot of wind. So we're going to start off underneath these trees, and then uh, we'll throw it in the high speed setting, and then we will get out in the open. DM009 can handle some wind. Uh, I don't know if it can handle the wind that we have right now. It's like a 20 mile an hour wind um, on and off, but we'll see. We'll throttle up and throttle down blinky 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 and then it binds up um we're in the third speed setting we're gonna give this a go yeah easy there buddy so right away there is no smoke the drone is not on fire <laughs> and we're gonna get out here in this wind we're gonna show off the dm009 and it's uh flying abilities this will be a mild time run on this. The wind's taking it. We're going to fight. Let's go. Let's go. DM009. Let's go. Yeah. DM009 is a fighter. This is going to be extremely, extremely aggressive flight for this guy. But it can hang. This drone can hang. I'm going to go ahead and just buzz out this way with the wind. Then we're going to come back. Woo, easy there. Easy there. Getting a little wobbly with that wind. This drone doesn't weigh anything either. It is ridiculous how well this drone works. Um, it's a 7.4 volt drone naturally. Turn around this way and fly towards the wind. Did originally come with a control, uh, not a controller, a camera. Um, decent camera. This has been known to lift the Q6 Amobius or even a light action camera. Um, so uh, it, it's definitely a good drone. I sell these all day, 35 ship lower. 48 USA. Um, I'll throw my eBay link down below. Uh, I have them marked used on eBay because I don't test every single one of them. Uh, the auction that we have going on for four of them, three of them work. One is for parts. I did test those and I did fire the motors. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. What wind? What wind? You think this was uh, related to the MJX Bugs uh, Bugs 3, and you would think it'd be brushless the way it's handling this wind, but that's not the case. This is a gear to gear, not even direct feed. Um, this is a gear to gear brush drone. Direct feed is generally a motor, and you have a propeller sitting on top of the motor post. This isn't that, and that offers a lot more power. This is motor, small gear, to larger gear that feeds these propellers. And this thing's hanging. This thing's hanging. Um, so far, the drone has not caught on fire <laughs> um, from my crude connection. Uh, my two one-cell batteries that are acting as a three-point, that are acting as a 7.4 volt, are wa working very good. Um, it's not hiccuping. I'm not losing power. This drone will not run on a 3.7 volt. I've already tried that because it has a standard lossy connection. Uh, so this is definitely definitely working something to consider guys if you have extra uh, 3.7s around you may want to do this mod you may not want to do this mod but for me it is working and we are pushing this as you can see this is where the winds coming from and the winds just taking it back taking it back and bam 
we can get out in it and we can fly forward no problemo this drone is a champ i have flown this drone in snow i've also flown bam look at it fly um i've flown this drone also in uh, rain which i don't suggest but the body's pretty much covered up so the inside guts didn't get wet and it did well uh i have lots of videos on this drone if you are new to the channel check out some of the videos if you're new to this drone check out some of the videos if you're new to the channel do me a favor smash that subscribe button if you have any questions comments concerns definitely get at me down below i think we are going to freeze our ears and hands off because i think this is going to get an epic flight time i really do think this is going to get an epic flight time because the standard 600 it, it, it fluctuates some of these came with a 500 milliamp an hour 7.4 volt some came with a 600 milliamp an hour we have 850 milliamp an hour in here um same voltage again we've increased the voltage we've not increased the milliamp an hour bam and that's flying right into the wind it's not struggling Whoop. This thing's a monster. This thing is a monster. This is, dude, if Walmart sold this drone, they would probably sell it for 100 I'm going to say $120. They sell the sharper image drones with the cameras, Wi-Fi cameras for around their uh, high retail. That's what they would do on this drone. They might even do more because of how good of a drone it is. $35, lower 48 if you know me on Facebook, I'll do that shipped. If uh, you want to buy from eBay, you are going to pay the shipping. Uh, link for those will be down below. Link for the lot of these will be down below. This thing is a monster. And I'm freezing. <laughs> I am freezing, guys. It is 20-some degrees out here. Um, it's a lot colder than what it was yesterday. Er, throw on the brakes. And we're just going, whoop, wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. Come on. I thought I turned around. I thought I rotated my yaw. There, have you rotated my yaw? Flying like a champion. And we'll bring this down here for a close look in front of the camera. If I could stabilize it in this wind, stabilize. I'm just going to kind of like, bam, there it is. There it is. It, whoop! I hit myself down and out. Should shut the motors down. That sucks. I wanted a full flight time on this. I wanted a full flight time on this. There we go. We're back up. We are back. Nope, that might be it. Maybe that's why I did it. There, it's full flight time, I guess. Um, let's see what type of time we got. I'd like to think that would have flown longer. Six minutes and 34 seconds. I don't think that was a full flight time. I do not think that was a full flight time. So guess what? We are going to reset. I think it went into, hey, we crash mode. Reset. I could be wrong, though. I could be wrong. We're going to turn this on. Or it's the cold and the high wind that was affecting this. So are we good? Did we rebind? We did rebind. Down and out. Yeah, we're back up. I, bam, we lost the we lost the leg. We lost the leg. Leg down. Leg down. Easy, 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 easy. This wind is picking up crazily. <laughs> they they whoo, easy, easy. <laughs> we had to set it down. We've crashed. We set it down. We've crashed. I don't know where that leg went. <laughs> Maybe it was on low voltage. And it's like, uh, hey, J drone. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> I don't know where that leg went. And what I tell you guys, that, uh, oh no, the battery popped out. Battery did pop out. I'm missing a battery. No, the other battery's still in there. The other battery is still in there. Um, we still have connection. I'd like to know where my leg went. Um, this was fun. This was fun. This was a good test. Uh, good use of these batteries. It was right here. It was right here somewhere. It was like right on the road, but I think the wind probably pushed it over in the snow and the landing gear is white. So chances of me finding it. Bam. Good eye. Good eye. We found it. We found it. So guys, this worked. Um, yeah, and it was definitely voltage as uh, my lights have now shut off. So I was pushing the limits. Or no, I've already turned it off, so I, I don't know. Um, super cold weather, super wind. Um, we're now at eight minutes, so maybe this saw a seven minute flight with uh, extremely aggressive, extremely cold conditions. If you haven't subscribed, do me a favor, smash the subscribe button. Wiring did not catch us on fire. Uh, this worked 